Now, the Senate Committee on Judiciary, Human Rights and Legal Matters on Friday said it would fix a date for a public hearing on the controversial Social Media Regulation Bill 2019 next week. This is coming barely four days after the contentious bill passed second reading on the floor of the Senate. The Nigerian Bar Association and human rights lawyers, especially senior advocates of Nigeria and sociopolitical groups, on Friday vowed to stump the public hearing to present their views on the bill. However, the chairman of the Senate Committee, Opeyemi Bamidele, in an interview on Friday said notice would be given to the relevant stakeholders because of the interest the bill had generated. The bill seeks to make provisions for protection from internet falsehoods and manipulations and other related matters. Popularly known as anti-social media bill, the legislation is being sponsored by the senator representing Niger East District, Sani Musa. Mami Dele hinted that his panel will hold meetings with the sponsor of the bill and the leadership of the National Assembly before convening the public hearing. Only a former governor of Enugu State, Senator Chimaroke Namani, spoke against the passage of the bill during the debate on its general principles. Senator Bala Naala also raised a constitutional point of order to draw the Senate's attention to the fact that the passage of the bill would be in conflict with certain provisions of the Constitution. Sani Bamidele, the sponsor of the bill, said proper arrangement would be made by his panel to collate the views of stakeholders and represent the views in his report. The bill, if signed into law, among others, prescribed a three-month jail term and a fine of up to 10 million naira for individuals or corporate firms that run afoul of its provisions. Meanwhile, the Federal High Court in Lagos it's fixed December 2, 2019 for a hearing of the case filed against the enactment of the anti-social media bill. A human rights activist and constitutional lawyer, Tokwe Akinyode, on November 12th filed an action in court against the proposed bill, which he claimed would encroach on the fundamental human rights of citizens to free speech if enacted. The National Assembly, Federal Republic of Nigeria, President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria and the Senate President were joined as respondents in the suit. He asked the court for an order of perpetual injunction to restrain the respondents from embarking and further proceedings over the said bill. In the lawyer's words, the bill is repressive and difficult to maintain without a brutal violation of the citizens' rights to free speech.